everyone, my name is Brother Bash, minister of the Rosary Road Church of Christ in Phoenix, Arizona. And this weekend, we are having our new convert seminar, and we are blessed to have faithful brethren in the Lord's Church who have agreed to deliver uh, classes that will help, um, foundational classes that will help our new converts grow. We have Brother Dewan Johnson from the Church of Christ Dallas at Fordham Road. He will be delivering some sessions via Zoom. We have Brother Nathan McPhee from the Parkview Drive Church of Christ out of Monroe, Louisiana. We have Brother Donnie Pretty from the South Phoenix Church of Christ in Phoenix, Arizona. So I want to start off, brothers, by saying thank you for taking the time to be a part of our New Convert Seminar. And I want to ask you, starting with Brother Johnson, I want to ask you, why is it important for the Church of Christ to have such seminars and classes and workshops to help our new converts grow? Brother Johnson. Well, it's important for the Church of Christ to have these type of seminars, uh, seminars for new converts, new babes in Christ, because uh, the Bible says, uh, as newborn babes desire the sincere milk of the word, that, why? It's for a purpose that you might grow thereby. And that's the most important thing. If you become a believer, you obedient to the gospel, uh, you must grow quickly uh, because Satan, <laughs> Satan is busy. Uh, being a newborn babe, we know that they, they're, they're kind of gullible, they're cute, and can easily be uh, used. And you, but you, this babe has found salvation, and Satan hates that. So you heard of that phrase, like taking candy from a baby, right? And so after you get in Christ. And, it, and you grow well and you come to growing by knowing what you believe uh, why you believe it it's a lot of Christians that don't know why they believe it. as newborn babes we must get into the word uh, be grounded in our faith know why you believe it what you believe uh, structure uh, get into the word that you might grow and work. Give them something to do, you know, because once you're in the world, you got a lot to do, ungodliness. And so once you come to Christ, you begin to grow. You need something to do in the kingdom of God. Uh, I don't mind is a devil's workshop. We all heard that before. And the Bible lets us know it's our job as men of God, as preachers and teachers to uh, to teach and to help these members grow. Amen. So that's uh, why I think it's important for the Church of Christ to have these type of sem seminars because new converts, they, they need it. I remember being baptized and uh, I carried my Bible around, uh, but I really wasn't in it. Amen. And I kind of fell away and I needed probably classes like these to keep me busy, to keep the word of God getting put in me that I might grow. So uh, that's the most important thing is growth if you want to make heaven your home. Uh, once again, I just give thanks uh, to God for the opportunity to be uh, joined hands with these brothers to uh, be a part of the seminar for our new converts. And uh, one thing that I want to share with every new convert, uh, the importance and it's very essential uh, towards uh, your salvation to continue to grow from an initial faith to a maintaining faith, a faith that is strengthened in the word of God. And we understand that faith comes by hearing and hearing by the word of God. So our faith, if we truly have faith in our conviction, we'll hold on to the profession, all firm to the end. And as a newborn babe, you have to realize that you have just came out of the world. So you have to get the word of God in you to get the word or to get the world out of you. And I and I hold on to that very sincerely because we have came from the devil's thoroughfare. We have came from the power of darkness. And now we are, have been translated into the kingdom of God. We have work to do, to do. We have gift that God has blessed us with that we used to abuse. And all of these things uh, happen for a reason, but God had you in mind before the foundation of the world. So we continue to grow, we continue to strive to be fit for God's use, God will use us, but he expects for us to keep his commandments and he expects for us to grow in the grace and knowledge of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. 
So I just commend uh, all new converts and, sh and share with them the importance to not only have the zeal for God, but have the zeal for God with a purpose that you are basically humbling yourself. You are conforming your will to do the will of God. So I just encourage everyone every day to continue to keep your eyes on Christ, continue to study your Bible with purpose, and always reach out to the, uh, those in the brotherhood if you have a desired question that needs to be fulfilled. And like Brother Bash always say, you give me a Bible question, I'm gonna give you a Bible answer. And that's what we want to do on this Saturday. We want to encourage you. We want to continue to help you understand that you can endure every trial and you can strive to escape the sin. I would say the biggest um, example we can probably get Brother Bash is, is that of the missionary journeys of Paul. When you go through Acts chapter uh, 13, 14, 15, 16, and especially 17, we see where Paul himself, uh, after he went and spread the gospel, he would go back and would uh, continue to teach and to encourage those new believers. Uh, Acts 17, 11, the Bible talks about those Bereans, how they studied and searched the scriptures daily. Uh, and more important, how they were uh, more fair-minded than those others. And so you're gonna have some that that uh, are on different levels. But at the end of the day, we all want to make it to heaven. We all want to be a blessing unto the Lord. And the biggest thing we can do, uh, as the other brothers can say, is not allow the enemy to pull us away. The enemy is gonna try every angle to discourage, not just babes, but senior, uh, older Christians. And, and what we need to do is to uh, sharpen our tools daily. Uh, we need to be in the word and doing seminars like this not only sharpens uh, the teacher, but it also encourages that new babe in Christ that I am on the right track. And now I need to get ready to teach that new babe coming in for we can keep this going. Uh, not just for a couple of weeks, but for a lifetime until Jesus calls us home.